Please welcome to the stage, Louis Black! <laughs> Let's, let's try to get a grip. Okay, I, obviously another long Minnesota winter. It's nice to be here in the summer because I've always come here in the winter and wondered why the fuck you would live here. Everyone always says, oh, you should come in the summer. They're exceptional. Well, yeah, because you can move your fucking fingers and toes. <laughs> you know, I, I like it here. It's a great city, but it's, uh, it, it, it's too fucking cold. <laughs> and, the, and the fact that seriously you don't laugh louder at that <laughs> is goddamn scary. You really, literally have no idea. You don't. You don't have any concept. You live in it. Much like when you watch someone and it's 90 degrees out and they're wearing a sweater and you're going, he's fucked up. <laughs> you live in a cold that human beings aren't supposed to live in. And it's no kind of test to the human spirit. It's fucking stupid. <laughs> when you have to plug in your engine to make sure it starts in the morning, that's a tip. <laughs> and when we, when we sit in there, you know, during the winter and you, you go, boy, you know, let's see what's happening in Minneapolis. And I'll go, fucking it's 20 below. <laughs> That is not weather. Uh, that's an emergency condition. <laughs> and at that point, if you had any brains, you call the federal government and you say, get us the fuck out of here. <laughs> Fly me to some place where it's like 20. settled Minnesota. It, to me, it's, it's beyond belief that, that, that people came here and, and, and fucking stayed. <laughs> I mean, there wasn't like there was something here and people went, oh boy, look, uh, there's a Walmart. <laughs> this will be great. <laughs> Minnesota, of course, was settled by uh, many people from Scandinavia, who literally, just in the 18th century, had had it with the country they were living. They turned to their friend and go, Sven, this is shit. I cannot live like this. It's fucking cold every night. I must find a new land. And then they got on a wooden ship, which is, I would, I'd never, okay? I never would have left. I'm serious. If I went down to the dock and they said, that's what you're gonna go on, I said, fuck you. First thing I wanna know is where am I gonna shit? And they got on a boat and they came across the sea and they got to the East Coast to a temperate climate. A temperate climate. <laughs> and then they decided to keep going. They'd arrived in a place which was already settled and what lay beyond was fucking, you, you, no one knew. And they went, no, let's go through the woods. <laughs> they literally had to think there is some place better where it is nicer. 
And to go through the woods at that time, imagine, because they're coming from Scandinavia, and now they're here, and God damn it, they're different fuck animals. <laughs> How creepy is that to turn the corner? Holy shit, look at that! <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> Let's eat it. And as they moved through the, uh, through the forest, as many Scandinavians do, they, they drank. <laughs> and as they drank, as they drank, and as they moved, they drifted toward the right. <laughs> and further and further north they went. Until they arrived in Minnesota and went, fuck, we're home. This is perfect, just as cold. Mm. <laughs> we had the, uh, the coldest winter on record this year, but mm, you people didn't notice. <laughs> it was an utter dog shit winter. And dog shit would have been better because it's warmer. <laughs> the dry cleaning bills are higher, but I don't care. 